please subscribe and you can download this code from description below. Exposing a std vector int as a python list using swig, simplified wrapper and interface generator, allows you to seamlessly integrate C++ code with python. Swig is a powerful tool for creating wrappers around C++ libraries, making it possible to use C++ classes and data structures in python. In this tutorial, we'll walk through the steps to expose a std vector into python using swig, with code examples along the way. Before you begin, make sure you have the following installed. C++ compiler, you need a C++ compiler like G++ or Clang. Swig, install Swig on your system. You can download it from Swig's official website. Python, ensure you have Python installed. Swig supports both Python 2 and Python 3. Let's start by creating a C++ header file, vector underscore exposer dot h that contains the declaration of a function to create and return a std vector int. Now, create a C++ source file, vector underscore exposer dot cpp, to implement the function defined in the header file. Next, create a swig interface file, vector underscore exposer dot i, that specifies how swig should generate the wrapper code. Open a terminal and navigate to the directory containing your files. Run the following command to generate the wrapper code using swig. This command tells swig to create a C++ wrapper file named vector underscore exposer underscore wrap dot cpp for python. Compile the C++ source code and the generated wrapper code using your C++ compiler. Replace slash path slash to slash python with the path to your python installation and slash path slash to slash swig with the path to your swig installation. Also, replace python x.y with your python version, example python 3.8. Now, you can create a python script to test the swig generated wrapper. Run the python script. You should see the output 1, 2, 3 which indicates that the std vector int has been successfully exposed as a python list. That's it. You've exposed a C++ std vector int as a python list using swig. This allows you to seamlessly work with C++ data structures in your python code, making it easier to leverage existing C++ libraries in your python projects. ChatGPT